Hi guys, I'm Kim from Brazil and I created this channel to be the solution if you're planning a trip to Brazil. You don't need to search in hundreds of blogs and channels. In this place, you'll find everything that helps you plan a trip to Brazil. Where to go, how long to stay in each city, what to do, a food guide, everything. So if you're considering a trip to Brazil, like the video, subscribe and let's go! In this video, I'm gonna tell you 10 beaches to go in Rio de Janeiro city and a very special tip if you don't want to show everybody you are a tourist. Brazilians, especially people from Rio de Janeiro, they all take one thing in common when they go to the beach. And let's go to the number one. Number one is Leme Beach. Or in Portuguese, Praia do Leme. Ah, guys, in another word in Portuguese, you have to know. Posto. Posto. It's like a reference or a meeting point to tell your friends where on the beach you are. For example, I'm on the left of posto number one. Or I'm riding from the posto number four. You know? Ah, and of course, it's also a place where you can find lifeguards, toilets, showers, and things like this. So, going back to the video, Lemi is the beginning. A lot of people think it's already Copacabana, but the, the posto number one, it's called Lemi. Copacabana Beach starts from posto number two. Lemi is a really nice place. Families and children go there. And there is a really nice kiosk there. Kiosk, it's a place to buy food and drinks. Number two, Copacabana. So, a couple of meters away, it starts Copacabana in posto number two. Probably the most famous beach. Guys, the beaches I'm telling you in this video are inside the city, so don't expect a relaxing place or a super peaceful place, uh, nature all around. No, it's inside the city. And I think Copacabana is very convenient. Probably your hotel will be a few steps away. It's full of options of restaurants, shops. Well, I think I don't need to explain Copacabana too much. It's a place where you have to go if you're in Rio and that's it. Number three, Arpoador. Guys, Arpoador is located between Ipanema and Copacabana. It's where some people go for surfing and the best of Arpoador is the sunset. You have to be there for sunset. It's so fantastic, don't miss it. Number four, Ipanema. And I know you say Ipanema, but if you want to sound more local, try to say Ipanema. But it's okay if you say Ipanema, Ipanema, of course we understand. And Ipanema is located in the south zone of Rio de Janeiro. You can get that, you can easily get there by metro, bus, walking. Although it's very close, for some reason, I believe Ipanema has the most beautiful watercolor than its neighbors, Copacabana and Leblon. So yes, Ipanema is a place where you have to go. Ah, and another thing, posto number 8, near Farme de Amoedo Street, Farme de Amoedo, this area is considered the gay area, so you're gonna see a lot of couples, uh, flags. Number 5, Leblon. Leblon is located in Posto 11 and 12, and that's considered one of the richest areas in the city. Guys, all of the five beaches have really good infrastructure, such as showers, uh, toilets, restaurants, and it's surrounded by hotels and buildings. It's possible to rent two chairs and one umbrella for less than $10. Another good point. Almost all the places take credit cards, so you don't need to take much cash with you. Ah, and by the way, Rio de Janeiro is a place where people go very relaxed to the beach. They don't care about their clothes, they don't take jewelry and things like this, you know? It's not a place to show off. Final and extra tip to look like a loco. If you're a girl or if you have a girlfriend, pay attention. All girls have a kanga. Kanga can be your dress to go to the beach, your bag to put your stuffs, you just need to watch some YouTube videos to know how to, how to tie it. It can be your towel after swimming, and guys, you're gonna see only few people who take proper towels on the beach. Like 80% of the people have a kanga to go to the beach. Almost everybody have a kanga. Or you can sit on it and then you don't need to rent a chair. You can buy this kanga on the beach, on shops. Well, in Brazil, do as Brazilians do. Guys, in this video, I told you five beaches to go in Rio de Janeiro and some tips. I believe you guys prefer when I make short videos. So in the next video, there will be the other five beaches. 
Well, the other beaches are more calm and to relax. So, of course, not so close to most of the hotels and apartments. And not so many shops. But there is much more nature and the watercolor pays off. See you in the next video, and if you're still here, it's because the video helped you somehow. So, if you can, please like the video, it helps a lot. Share with your friends who are considering a trip to Brazil, and subscribe. And follow me on my Instagram, it's where I daily give tips about Brazil. Have a wonderful time here! Bye!